Hello YouTubers, I'm Parviz and this is our 41st video in Android application development. In this video I'm going to talk about uh, Bluetooth, so how you can use uh, Bluetooth uh, in your Android Studio. So now let's get started. I've created a new project and uh, I'm going to just give a simple design for my this application. Let me remove this hello world and uh, also, I need to change the layout, so let me change it to relative layout. So, relative layout. <coughs> okay, now I need three buttons, so let me give the first one, uh, the second one. so and also the third one okay let me change the id so this is uh, btn on yes on <coughs> This is BTN off the ID. And this is visible. Okay, now uh, let me just bring the XML and I need to give an on click listener for these. So for the first button, Android on click and I call it for example on click let me copy this and I want this for my two more buttons on click <coughs> and on click okay so now let me create this method in my Java file public void on click and you need to give the view in here so view view let me import this okay so first uh for uh interacting with bluetooth uh you need to first create a bluetooth adapter so let me create bluetooth adapter i call it bluetooth adapter so now we need to uh, instantiate this Bluetooth adapter class Bluetooth adapter dot get default adapter okay so after this and now in the method we are going to on off and show the visibility of our Bluetooth our device Bluetooth so if view dot get ID so if this is r dot ID dot btn on so in this case uh, I'm going to create an intent so intent intent new uh, let me import this intent okay new intent and in here we need to uh, give uh, Bluetooth adapter dot uh, action request enable and after that we are going to start activity for result for result and you need to give your intent and the uh, request code is zero okay now in the else if section so else if so if view dot get id so it is the r dot id dot btn off okay 
Okay, so if this is the case, we are going to uh, so Bluetooth adapter dot disable. We are going to disable the Bluetooth. So <coughs> now let me uh, just run this. Uh, but uh, before running, uh, you need to open uh, your manifest file and you need to add a permission. So we need to add uh, so uses permission and we need to add Android Bluetooth permission. Okay, so now let me just check this that uh, how it's working or not. Let me run this in my virtual emulator. So now I'm waiting for this. So guys, now you can see uh, this is my uh, virtual emulator. Uh, if I click uh, for right now, you can see uh, my Bluetooth is off. Uh, but if I click on on, so application is requesting permission to turn on Bluetooth. And if I click yes, and you can see uh, my Bluetooth is on. So if I click on off, uh, we have a problem in here. <coughs> Let me just check this in the off because uh, so in here I have a problem and uh, Bluetooth adapter dot disable. So if I change this to Bluetooth adapter dot disable. So guys, uh, it's because uh, the problem is because I have I don't have Bluetooth admin permission. So you can see missing permission required. And uh, now uh, in the manifest, you need to add another permission. So uses permission and we need Bluetooth admin permission so now let me just run my application again so now I am waiting so now you can see uh, right now my Bluetooth is on if I click on off you can see uh, my Bluetooth became off on so yes and if I click on off now it's off so now I'm working on the visibility uh, for this uh, in here you can see now the error is gone let me create another else if else if view dot get id so if it is our dot id dot uh it's uh, i haven't changed btn with so uh, let me just uh, change this the id i have forgot to change the id to btn visible dot btn visible so if this is the case uh let me create an intent so intent intent new intent and in here we need to action request discoverable we need to uh, call this so bluetooth adapter dot action request discoverable and in here uh, we need to start activity for result our intent and the request code is one also because we have two requests uh, we are going to add uh, on activity result in here we need to override on activity result so now this is the uh, our simple code let me just run it again so now I am waiting Okay guys, so this is my application. If I click on off, on, so now it's becoming on. If I click on off, 
uh, Bluetooth is becoming off and if I click on visible so you can see application is requesting permission to turn on Bluetooth and click on yes now it's visible so like this you can work with Bluetooth uh, thank you guys if you have any question please let me know and for the further videos please subscribe my channel and also like the videos